All right, so when we do dividing fractions, we do keep flip change. So we're going to go ahead and keep our first fraction as 77 over 4. We're going to change our division sign to multiplication and then flip our second fraction. So now we have 4 sevenths. And we're going to go ahead and figure out what is 77 times 4. 77 breaks down into 70 and 7. 4 times 7 is 28, adding on a 0. 4 times 7 is 28. We're going to add our values of... 280 plus 28. 0 plus 8 is 8. 8 plus 2 is 10. Carrier 1, 308. And our denominator, 4 times 7, is simply 28. So how many pieces of ribbon does she have? She has 308 over 28 pieces of ribbon. So that fraction does not really help our uh, answer it all, even though mathematically it's correct, we need to break it down into mixed numbers or whole numbers to find how many pieces of ribbon she has. Because if we tell our answer is 308 over 28, although it is correct, it is not completing the question. So 308 over 28. All right. This is asking how many 28s go into 308. We're going to go ahead and do some long division. Draw your boxes. Does 28 go into 3? Nope. Does 28 go into 30? It does. 11. I'm sorry, 1. 28 times 1 is 28. We're going to subtract it out. 30 minus 28, you have 2. Bring down your 8. 28 goes into 28 one time with no remainder. So our answer, our quotient is 11. So in our question, whoa, oh no, okay. In our question, how many pieces of ribbon does she have? She has 11. That's our answer.